Back to the thrift store guys, Bayou Village. And the first thing I spotted today was these two. Wow, these are vintage. These are, must be 70s or eight, 1980s. It's gotta be, these are gotta be over 50 years old. On off switch, Magnavox TV. Well, that one's a TV. There seems to be a radio on it. The cheaper one at 19 bucks, it's got a radio on it. That's pretty cool. These are really dirty. These have been stuck in someone's garage for forever. <laughs> yeah, I, you know what? As a kid, I would have loved one of these in my bedroom. Or on the back of my bicycle. With big, a, what was it? DDD batteries in it. What's that? Caution. Do not let it catch fire. Sears Limited. Oh, so this one's from Sears. It's got horizontal and vertical hold on the side. UHF. Got an antenna connection on that side. Uh, tuner. Brightness, volume on the front. This one's got... Um, so look. This is the Magnavox. Oh, Magnasonic. Vintage Magnasonic TV radio unit. This one does actually have a radio in it. Not really worth a lot though. Um, I looked it up, 69 bucks. So at 20 bucks, you know, you're not going to get much. Thing is though, do they work? So I went to the Value Village plug it in and see table. We'll start with the just the TV one first. Once they get the elastic band off it. Standard plug. Plug her in. And there's a big on off button. Nothing. It clicks. I don't think you could hear that but it just clicked. I went through every button on this guys. Couldn't even get the screen to flicker. So let's try the TV radio. Yep, got some radio sounds. Might pick something up outside. And the antenna at the back, put my finger on it, try and get it to work. No, nothing nothing on that. Turn the volume up. But when we switch channels, go to UHF or whatever F whatever F it is. It comes to life. There you go. Screen. The screen still works. Wow, it's like 60 year old maybe and the screen fires up what's the chance of, this, of that screen actually working that's amazing I'm, I'm impressed just that the screen lights up anything else is a bonus now <laughs> I don't think there's any uh, programs though although I can pick up TV and on, on an antenna at home but that's um, digital over antenna I don't think I get any programs with this one Keep twiddling, twiddle a few, keep twiddling through. There's all different ranges. Let's just quickly go through all the ranges, but no, nah, nothing. But then I had a look at the uh, toy shelf and come across a couple of uh, little Star Wars things. Ten bucks for this, what do you think, guys? Ten dollars? It's probably at its money. It doesn't seem to turn on. A lot of these toys, they've all got dead batteries anyway. Somebody took the batteries out, or they just left on. But yeah, for ten bucks, yeah, little bebop. They're pretty cool. And let's have a look more Star Wars stuff. This is an X-wing cardboard model that you can build. There's supposed to be a book in the box. So look, just using one hand here to try and get in the box. Yeah, there's the instructions. On oh, there's the X-wing. Never been touched. Brand new. I think that was uh, four ninety nine, five bucks. How old is it though? Can't be that old. Disney one as well. Two thousand sixteen. 